Hey guys, what's up? My name is Jared Ward, and today I'm going to be discussing Sir Ken Robinson's TED Talk and his idea of bringing creativity back into education. He, um, he started off and he made a good point about how creativity really isn't as relevant in today's education as it should be. He pointed out that he wants it, or he believes it should be as relevant as literacy, or should be taught as much as literacy is in education. Um, he he kept me pretty engaged, and I'm pretty sure he kept the audience engaged by using his uh, com comedic value, or adding comedic value to uh, what he was talking about. Normally, if I were to see that up, that or see like a, a post that says, um, today, so-and-so will be talking about creativity and education, I'd probably be interested because of the creativity part, but if you were to sit there and just watch someone talk about that without being funny or without really having any stories or relevancy to anything they're saying, just completely talking about a subject, I'd probably get bored just throughout that nine minutes. I'd probably fall asleep, honestly. But the way he um he went about it was actually pretty it was pretty entertaining. He'd um he'd tell a story or a joke and he'd make that joke or story relevant to his next subject that he'd present in the, throughout his whole idea. And um, I feel like that's that's one of the commandments he really followed well of uh, all the Ted Ten Commandments was number eight, just um, thou shalt, uh, I don't know, basically keep the crowd laughing or laughter is good. And I think that that was his um, his main thing he did really well, and that's what kept me engaged. Dynamically, um, I give him a four because I'd say he he could have moved around a little bit. I noticed he was actually just really solid in the center of the stage. I don't know if you know maybe he has an issue walking or with his legs or he's just kind of old, but. He was kind of just in one spot. I prefer to see someone, you know, moving around, getting um, engaged with the crowd. But I guess he did do that throughout his um, his jokes and his stories. I was um, so that was one thing that kept me in. Um, one thing I learned from him though is that when you're talking about something, it's it's really good to be passionate about it because you can tell it, it was really easy for him to just go about what he was saying. He you know, like it's like he was just talking to a friend. You know, he'd uh, he'd throw in a story, a joke, make them laugh, joke about the joke, and then he'd be like, all right, back to the point. But he, the thing is, he didn't have to say that. He'd flow really well from joking, and then his tone would get a lot more serious as he was stating his point. And um, I think that's one thing that that every speaker should have is a easy, consistent flow. And I think that's done through having confidence in what you're talking about or having passion for the subject that you are discussing. Um, so overall, I'd say it was a good speech. Actually, um, I enjoyed it. I sat there, and I was actually into what he was talking about. So I give him a 10. And hopefully I can do the same.